Mm, yeah, what's good to you two? Man, it's your boy, Miss. Hey, man, I got another upload for y'all. As you can see by the title, I'm gonna show y'all some combos, some dribble moves, a little quick dribble tutorial for all y'all beginners. After this, after watching this video, y'all not gonna need screens, like for real. You don't need screens. If you're a playmaker with a 90 something ball handle, you're not gonna need screens. You shouldn't even use screens in the beginning. But I'm gonna show y'all some of these easy moves. Um, but yeah, I don't have a hand cam, so I'm gonna have to just explain this stuff. Uh, these moves you're probably not gonna get on the first try, so you know, practice makes perfect all the time. But hey, my last video just hit 3,000 views for all y'all new subs that subbed after watching that. Hey, um, hey. Just turn on post notice so y'all don't miss another um upload. Um, but yeah, um, like and sub, you know, if Black Lives Matter to you, as you can see in the back, everything that's going on, you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, I'm trying to hit 1k subs, so you know, let's try to sub up. If y'all new to the channel, just press sub. I don't even care about likes, we have zero likes. I don't even care. I just need y'all to sub up, you know what I mean? But hey, um, with no further ado, let's get into this video. It's your boy, I don't miss. And let's get into the video. And now, this world shall know pain. Some justice. You strive for your own sense of justice, and I strive for my own virtue. So do you. Find So as y'all can see in the first um first clip, that's what I did. That's the misdirection behind the back. Um, that was using a screen, but usually if you don't do it with a screen, you can still get open. So that's one of the moves that's really good. So in order to do that move, this is standing. This is wild standing. You're gonna hold the right trigger, right? If it's in your um, let's see, if it's in my right hand, I'm gonna pull the right trigger. I mean not right trigger, the right stick diagonal to the opposite side. See what I'm doing? So I'm holding down the right trigger, right? And whatever hand it's in, I'm alternating. Like, I'm not alternating, but I'm pulling it diagonal to that direction. So it might give you a crossover, but look, see right here? When you get it, it's, it's easy. So I'm holding on the right trigger. I'm just pointing diagonal, pointing the right stick diagonal every time. And that's why standing. So if you ever, you know, stuck in your center, setting the screen right next to you, hit that behind the back, just like that. See how much, like, see how much, like, it just, like, you take, like, three steps off of that. And it's easy, it's easy space. So here's like a combo you could try to do, you know what I mean? So do a little step back, do you fake them, right? And then, you know, like, I don't know. I'm just saying like, you know, using like these little moves, you can easily go past people. So see how I just did the behind the back and you just tell you that behind the back, it just sets you up for jump shots. So just hold that right trigger and then pull that right stick diagonal. So if it's in your right hand, right, you're gonna just um, pull it diagonal. To the right and then if it's on your left hand hold the right trigger and then pull it diagonal down to the right and then uh, if it's in your right hand it's your right hand pull it diagonal to the left and then you know left hand to the right so just like the opposite just like that and you'll just get that behind the back animation every time just like that and then um yeah it's just easy dunk so that's the first move that's that behind the back um and in the clip what i did for that was while i was moving right um, I was going to the left. So when you're moving, you just release everything and then do the behind the back, which I just said how to do. But yeah, that's the first move. Go to the now next, next um, that is next move is the quick stop. So it might not look like a quick stop to you, but I guarantee it's going to be a quick stop for you. So look, see what I do. See like that animation it gives me. See how I'm like, I'm running, I'm running. And then like, I do this little move, but then like the ball glitches. So that's how it needs to look. So as you can see, when I do the move, right, when I'm about to do it, all I'm doing is hitting down on the right stick. And then right when it's doing the animation, I shoot. So I'm going to do it again. I'm going to run over to this side, flicking down. Look, see how it just stops? And I'm greening it every time. Like, I call this a quick stop, you know, because, like, if you're taking a screen from someone and you're just running away, you're just running off of somebody, right, they're going to be on the side of you. And you know how contest works. Contest only works from... You know the front or like kind of the side there they're right in front of you so basically like if you're doing it right and you're running away and you flick down that right stick your defender is not going to have enough time to close out on you 
than if you did like the whole entire move. So if you were to flick down, wait for the ball to like go, like wait for you to do the whole move and then shoot, they would contest you. But you know, if you don't do that, you just flick it down and then wait right when the ball like goes, like right when the ball goes, just shoot that joint. And it's gonna give you a quicker release and they won't be able to contest you. Now, another way you can stop yourself is just do a dribble move and just pop the three. So look, I'm just doing a regular dribble move. I'm just going and you see how I just shoot it. Like it just pulls me at the animation. It's like when you're like going back and forth, and if you it like if you just feel a little bit of openness, just shoot it, and it's gonna just stop you. See, I'm just going back and forth. They they want to they won't expect you to just stop and pop. They won't even expect you to do all that. So yeah, that's why it's called that. Now what I'm finna show y'all next is the curry spam. So you know this. Look at that. Just look. Just look. Like you can really spam that. You know what I mean. Hold down left trigger so they can't rip you. You can spam that and just go either left or right. You're going to get a little speed boost. Look at that. I'm just going back. I'm just crossover, crossover, crossover. I'm just, look at that combo. Like, I'm pretty sure that one move it will hit off someone's leg. But like, you can really just spam that joint and go right past them. So what you do, right, you hold down the trigger. Actually, no, don't hold down the trigger. I was kidding about that. So you don't hold down, you don't hold down anything but the right stick, right? And you're just going to, you're just going to keep rotating. Just keep on flicking that right stick. Left, right, left, right, left, right. Until you feel like... You want to go somewhere just look and that's why it's called the curry um curry spam for me because you can only you you can only do it with curry size up so you go get curry size up and then just go left right left right left right on that um crossover and just it'll give you this animation every time so look i'm just going boom 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 and look just you don't even got to do it just do it like two times just like just just hit it with the doom 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 and then you're just gonna go and it should give you it's gonna give you a speed boost animation so just be ready for, to get that speed boost animation. If you hold down the right trigger while doing this, it might mess up the move. So make sure you're not holding down the right trigger. You can hold down the left trigger so they can't strip you. But yeah, so that's going to be that move. So just get the curry size up and just keep spamming that joint. And the second you feel like he's backing up or something, you get that speed boost. That's all you got to do. That's just the best thing. Now the next move I'm finna get into is the speed boost hop step. So, you know how Duke Dennis goes, you know what I mean? Um, how he does a little hop step and then they just fall. So, it's like this, but it's just for comboing. So, all I'm doing is I'm holding down the right trigger and I'm just pulling the right stick down. And it's going to give you this little hop. See what I'm doing? Just give you that little hop animation. And if you have your meter on, your meter will pop up and people will think you're about to shoot. So, you can really just keep spamming this joint. But well, not spamming because, you know, it takes stamina. So, but you know, this is for people that play you up high. And you have, if you have Space Creator on Hall of Fame, you could easily get an ankle burger off this move. So, you know, just hold down the right trigger and then um, pull the right stick down. So, you know, if people that play you up high, you can just keep pulling them down and they should fall or back up. And then you have like just a limited, just, you have as many moves as you want to get past them after that moment. So, you know, if they play you up high, just look at it, look at the combo, just keep pulling them back. And people are not going to expect you to even do this move. You know, people are guarding you. They just say, they're just like thinking, oh, he's a playmaker. He's gonna zigzag and hide behind the screen. But you know, he's playing you up high, and you do that little look at that. Just hit him with the boom, and then pull it out, and then do it. You're gonna do it again. They're not even gonna be ready for that. They're not gonna be ready for that second one. So you should lose them after that one. But yeah, that's the hop step. So if you ever have to run off to the one side, just do that. Just hold down the right trigger, pull that right stick down. And it's going to give you that little uh, jump. And then you can control it with your left stick, too. So wherever you want to go, wherever you want to go um, after that, just just um, hold your or point your left stick to wherever you want to go. So if I do this step back right and I want to go left, I'm going to pull my left stick to the um, I pull my left stick to the left. And if I want to go right, I'm going to pull my left stick to the right. But I mean, you don't have to do that. That's extra. But, I mean, that's if you want to just control the direction. But usually, the hop step makes you go wherever I'm um, at once. But, yeah, that's that move. For my next move, this is my personal favorite. So, it is the spin out. So, the spin out can be used, you know, if someone's playing you up high, you want to surprise them for all y'all shooters. So, right now, the ball's on my left hand. I'm holding down the right trigger. I'm pulling my left stick down. And then I'm rotating my right stick in a half circle down. And it should give you that spin out every time. Um, this move is good because no one expects it. And when they when that does happen, they're just they don't know what they don't know what else you're gonna do after that. And you know, I'm holding down LT to get that glitchy behind the back. And, you know, I'm finishing in the paint. 
And um, just remember, whenever y'all hold down LT and do the um, the behind the back, you'll just glitch right past them. So yeah, that's the spin out. Now that was different from the first clip I showed you. That was while moving. This one is standing. It's all about mind games. So first, what you want to do, right, is you want to hold on the right um, trigger. This is really not a move. You want to hold on the right trigger, right, and then point the right um, point the right stick the direction whatever ball you have. So if you have the ball in your right hand, point it to the right. It should give you this little step, right. When it gives you that little step, do the behind the back. And the thing about this move is, right, when you when you do that little step to the side, they're gonna think, oh, he's he don't know what he's doing, or like, oh, maybe he's tired or something. So you, you hit them with a little step and then go right behind the back and just teleport you over there. And you have that easy way, especially the center such a screen. So you can do this. You can do this in my career too. The AIs, when you do that little half, um, little half step to that side and then do the behind the back, the AIs just stand there. They just stand there like dummies. And then we do the behind the back. You just shoot that, and it's easy shooting badges. Um, I was gonna make a shooting badge video with that move, but there was no point since I was making this video. But yeah, so tell your center to hold the screen. Uh, hold on the right trigger and then point it to whatever ball whatever side the ball hand is on and then do the behind the back the opposite direction and it should um and it should freeze them up they should just be standing there and that's easy green but yeah that's that move hey it looks like y'all made it to the end of the video for all my real ones you know what i mean y'all really made it y'all really watched the whole thing that really means a lot um but yeah um that's all i have for y'all today some little bit of drum moves that y'all can try out in y'all my course and y'all um, part games, tell me if it gets y'all open. You know what I mean? I like uh, doing helpful videos. Maybe you can comment um, what you want me to post again. I do jump shot videos. I see I really get a lot of views with the jump shot videos. But yeah, um, subscribe and turn on post notice. Like the video. Come on, we trying to, we, we 50 away from 200 subs, man. Let's try to get to 200 subs. Um, let's say in, in the next two weeks. Try to get 200 subs in the next two weeks. Let's go, man. If y'all are my real fans, like it up, sub up for all y'all new people. But yeah, uh, that's all I got for y'all today. Check out my other videos. It's your boy, I don't miss. And I'm out. Peace. Mm -hmm.